Hi guys, my name is Erin and I'm a group exercise instructor. Welcome to my cardio and core workout for the day. I'm really excited. Uh, just a reminder though before we start, you guys should have completed a warm up before my portion of the workout. And you guys can do a walk or a run, a 20 minute walk or run before or after my portion. Um, on the agenda today, we have six supersets. A superset is two exercises repeated back to back three times each for a, a total of three minutes per superset because we're doing 30 second intervals. Does that make sense? So there'll be two exercises, like I said, per superset for 30 seconds each repeated back to back three times. All right, it'll make more sense when I uh, explain it more, but let's get into our first superset for the day. All right, so our first superset is going to be a walking lunge, or our first move of our first superset, sorry, is a walking lunge. So we're making 90 degree angles with our knees not extending over our toes, right? Keeping it right here, straight, back straight, back flat, chest lifted, neck long. And to add impact, you guys can do a jump lunge. like that that's your first move of your first superset second move we're on the ground in a bridge so our heels are planted our feet are planted on the ground we are lifting up engaging our glutes and our hamstrings and lowering so just bridges again for that 30 second interval and then for example after completing the lunges and the bridges you would get back up do another set of lunges bridges lunges, bridges, and that's your first superset. Again, three minutes total in length. All right, moving on to our second superset. Our first move is going to be a star jump. So you're gonna to wanna to line your feet up, about shoulder width apart, load and explode, okay? Landing nice and even. To take the impact out, you guys can just do a regular standing squat. That is your first move of your second superset. Second move, we're on the ground doing Spider-Man push-ups. So the only difference between a regular push-up and a Spider-Man push-up is with the Spider-Man push-up, your knee comes out as you lower, okay? Just like that. Option here, you can take it on your knees or you can just do a regular push-up and that'll be your second move of your second superset. All right, moving on to the third superset. We are on the ground again, doing bicycles. So opposite elbow comes to opposite knee, alternating bicycles. These can be as fast or as slow as you want them to be. But then after that interval, that 30 second interval, we're coming back up and we have alternating lateral lunges for our second move of our third superset, okay? So for these, we lunge to one side, our weight is back in our heels, our chest is lifted, our neck is long, alternating sides. When we do these, we make sure, again, that our knees don't extend over our toes, keep it back just like this, nice and stable. And that is your second move of your third superset. So we're halfway through, we've got We've got three more to go, okay? Fourth superset is just going to be a regular jump, jump squat. So we line, we line our feet up, shoulder width apart again. To take the impact out, you can just do a regular standing squat. Chest is still lifted, chin is still up, back is still flat. Second move of our fourth superset, we're on the ground in mountain climbers. So high plank position, driving our knees up towards our chest. We're making sure to keep our shoulders stacked on top of our wrists. Again, these can be as fast or as slow as you want them to be. Option here, you can just hold a high plank. Otherwise, we're up. And that is the end of your fourth superset. Fifth superset, we're on the ground, leg lifts. So we straighten our legs, we're lowering and lifting, nice and easy. You guys can place your hands under your glutes. 
And we're making sure not to arch our back, right? No arches. We want to engage the core the entire time. Keep it stable. And then for our second move of our fifth superset, we're up in butt kicks. Take the impact out. You could just do a modified butt kick. Modified butt kick. All right, final superset. You're almost there. You have skaters. First move of your sixth superset, skaters. So you're touching the ground, you're in a curtsy squat. So it should be pointed straight, right? Weight is again back in our heels, but we're touching the ground, alternating skaters. All right, for our final move of our final superset, we are on the ground in a low plank this time, doing hip dips. Just like that, regular high, we're regular low plank, our back is flat, our core is engaged. Just twisting from side to side, dipping our hips. Shoulders should again be stacked on top of our elbows. And that is your final move of your final superset. So to end the workout today, I have a finisher for us. And that is a set of 10 burpees. A burpee can be whatever you want it to be. There's so many modifications. You could jump and then go to a high plank and do a push up. Coming back up, you could take the impact out, just go to a high plank, and back up. You could jump, go back down, do a plank jack, and come back up. Whatever you want it to be, just 10 reps, and you're finished with my portion. Just let me make sure that I didn't skip over anything. Yeah, so again, just a reminder, you guys should have warmed up before this. Uh, you can complete a 20 minute walk or run before or after my portion. And in order to get points towards winning the prizes, you guys have to post a selfie in the comment section of this video. All right, thank you so much.